Headwater streams are the smallest parts of a river or stream network, but they make up almost 50% of Austin's protected waterways. Because headwaters drain small areas, about a half a square mile, they are very sensitive to changes in the land surrounding them. Pollutants like nutrients and sediment are transported to larger streams where they combine with the pollutants from all the other headwaters. Because they represent the majority of our stream network, they are the lifeblood, the capillaries of our water resources. Protecting headwater streams can spur large water quality improvements throughout the entire system. Headwaters are particularly vulnerable to human activities because they are harder to see and easier to disturb than larger channels. A headwater stream may not have water flowing in it very often, but it is still vitally important to the health of the entire system. Before the 2013 Watershed Protection Ordinance, headwaters were only protected in the western drinking water watersheds, leaving the small streams in the eastern watersheds vulnerable to disturbance. The new ordinance expands protection to 400 additional miles of streams by requiring development to set back at least 100 feet from the center of the stream. This is enough space to filter out pollutants, slow runoff, enhance base flow, and provide shade for the stream. If you'd like to learn more about stream setbacks or the other provisions of the new Watershed Protection Ordinance, please see our informational videos at austintexas.gov.